list of number ones. Ranker Reddy and Shetty, the in-form men's doubles crew from India. That's coming up right now. Well, the men's doubles division is another keenly contested affair. And as you can imagine, all the big names have turned up for the Super 1000. Uh, Sio and Kang, the new world champions, up against Asan and Setiwan. That's in the top part of the draw. Winner of this match would play uh, either Kasuma Wadana and Rambitan or Endo and Take in the bottom half of this draw. Lee Wang and Su Ye will fight out for the top half opponent. But really, in this part of the draw, uh, it's a lot of big names in the men's doubles division. You can see match is still ongoing. Court one and court three. Oh, singles matches. The big news in the men's doubles. Well, Alfian and Ardianto, the world number ones, have had a bit of a nightmare in round one. And they were out to Astrup and Rasmussen, who are still in really good form from the world championships. And also another Indonesian pair, Karnando and Martin, also out, as are the Popoff brothers. And that's all on day one, this being day two, of course. Oh, what else can you say about Rankiredi and Shetty? They are clearly pointing their ship towards being world number one. And they would, of course, be the first world number one Indian men's doubles pair. You can see leading 3-1 last time they met was a huge mammoth affair at the Thailand Open earlier. I wonder if we're going to be in for one of those. You've won the toss. Receiving who will receive? Receiving and serving? And which side? Both of these pairs quarter-finalists at the recent World Championships in Denmark. And having a quarter-final run, obviously a great run. They would have loved to have gone a little bit further and got themselves a medal by getting to the semis, but you just get the feeling with Rank Reddy and Chetty especially that they're just never satisfied with the results that they're getting and they always want to go one step further. And at the age that they're at, and you can start speculating, saying they're going to be pretty good. Now, the Agus Malana, 25 years old, Chilachap, Indonesia. Highest ranking is 11 and currently at 13. There's his partner, Mohamed Shoribul Fikri. And Bandung, going as high as 11. So as you can expect, this is going to be a very fast-paced affair. A lot of power. That's something that Rank Reddy and Shetty have been trying to put into their game with their very experienced coach Matthias Bart. they've been trying to add those softer skills they've got the big power from backcourt as you can imagine the steep angles both of them being very high 187 centimeters to Shetty but they've been rapidly moving up the rankings and developing their game and that's what it's all about it's about building your game and they still have a lot more to come when they first hit the scene it was all about power and it was all about getting onto that attacking third shot as fast as they could and as powerful as, as, as putting as much power in as possible. And even just at the beginning of this year in January at the Malaysia Open, it was still all about steep angles and power. Now they're looking to get better at these flat exchanges, looking to find space a bit more, and also looking to, Ready to play. push their opponents into different areas. Let's see where they come up with in this one.
Umpire for this one, Philip Ayong Chi from the USA. Joined by our service judge, Shi Zhu Yun. So about ready to get underway here. Siraj, Raki Reddy, and Chirag Shetty, India. And on my left, Bagus Molana and Mohamed Chohaibel Fikri, Indonesia. Mohamed Chohaibel Fikri to serve to Satwick Siraj, Raki Reddy. Bravo. Play. Fast and Furious is what I said would happen, and that first point just vanishes into a very quick rally indeed. As I said, both pairs quarterfinalists at the World Champions Championships. Great run from Rankaredi and Shetty recently. They were first at the Korean Open, the Indonesian Open, Swiss Open as well. Those are the three titles they picked up this year, but also that third at the Malaysian Open and a quarterfinalist spot in Japan as well means recently in the last few months they've really picked up their form oh, out. for Vickery and Maulana runner up at the Thai Open and all your Masters and quarter finalists at the Swiss Open All England and Indonesia Masters as well so accolades on both sides of the net Two titles for Fikri Malana coming in 2019 and last year. All England Open, of course, They're a big one. So no stranger to winning at Super 1000 level. There's a big shot from Shetty. Service over. Two, three. Smart play from Fikri and Marlana, keeping it as flat as possible, Three, just oh. nullifying the threat of these big shots from backcourt for Chirag and Satwick. And he's done well so far. Oh, that's a really nice shot into the left flank. That was intentional, and that was absolutely masterful. If it wasn't, Five, it's very lucky. But it actually looked like he may have been going for that. Five three up. They are very good pair, Chirag and Satwick, but they are also beatable Six, in this early three. part of their career. 
just got to know what to do. And he'll do it at the right time. So far, that's what Fikri and Malana are doing well. There is Matthias Boa. Absolutely revolutionized top of setup in the Indian national team. Combinations. They just couldn't make the last shot, but that's good pressure from them. That's what they need to do. They need to play as fast as possible and as flat as possible. Keep the Indian pair on the defensive. And then they might just be able to stop this steamrolling momentum that Frank Reddy and Shetty have built up over the last couple of tournaments. Pumped up for this one. Seven, six. Hmm. 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 That's good. That's good from Ranker ready. I have to say. Owner of the fastest smash in badminton. That's well publicized news now. But interestingly enough, in this match so far, he hasn't had a chance to unload that. That's what I mean about keeping it flat. Forcing them to play a different type of game. Again, a flat exchange. And former All England winners have come through on top. Eight, seven. making it awkward and very difficult for the world number twos at the moment trying to push them off their rhythm right from the start of the match service over eight oh still nothing between them right now as we move towards or edge towards that first mid-game interval. So Nicely snatched by Fikri. Nine, eight. Short, 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 short. Out. <laughs> Service over. Nine, all. First big smash opportunity for Ranker Reddy. He lifts again. Tried to lift to the back court. A couple of errors creeping into their game. It's 10 9 on the serve for Fikri Malana. A balanced outfit, Fikri Malana. Roughly the same height. But they move very well. 11, 9, interval. And right now they're dominating that all-important third shot. So 11, 9, seven minutes played. That's the pace I was talking about, but it's the Indonesian pair ahead. Yeah, 
Court two, 20 seconds. Court two, 20 seconds. <laughs> So, on call for the second phase of game one, and Ranky Reddy getting a little bit of a talking to from the umpires, getting ready on time. It's been the running theme on court two this morning, actually. I, uh, Ahori also reminded the same thing. Over 10, 11. Important couple of points for Satwig and Shirag. Oh, oh that's how nervous. Service over. Nervous service. 12, 10. It's a mark of respect for their opponents, I guess. If you are that phased by the oh, surface. <laughs> well, we've really broken down in terms of play here on court two. Out. There's a challenge coming from that too. So two shots. Yes. One that came from one side of the net, one that came from the other. Such an important point as well at 12-10. Uh, so probably worth the challenge. Again, a lengthy challenge that they're waiting for. If you didn't think this match was nervous enough. Oh, it's genuine concern on the players' faces as to where this challenge is coming from. And the heartbeat stopped. Yeah. I'm sure they're working on that challenge for the game. Cannot continue until we have a... There it is. Determination on that serve, and that's it. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. Service over. 11-12. Play. Well, how important was that point for Ranky and Shetty? Well, if we were denied a rally with the length of that challenge, we certainly made up for it with that one. That's great. And what a way to tie it up at 12 each. 12 all. Unified 13, front from Fikri and Marlana. Power their way through. Fascinating matchup so far. So Again, flat, fast. 14, just right. And I have to say, it's a shame that one of these pairs has to exit at this round both of them as I said easily qualified in terms of term skill and experience to make the quarterfinals in the business end of the tournament that's deep serve and that's an easy kill for Fikri what a time to pull that one out absolutely wrong footed Chirag Shetty have a look at it he's falling backwards 
Quickly up and 12. straight down the middle. Beautiful combination. Little tricks and little tips. Pulling out the right attack at the right time. That's what it's all about. 15-12 on serve. Oh. Now they just seem to be a bit calmer. 16. Pushing ahead nicely. Just the right time in the game as well. to get off the defensive and start planning something off this serve because those last four points were clinical from Fikri Malana. A shot to forget. 17, 13. Well, we've got to that part of the game where Rankaredi and Shetty cannot make any more mistakes, which is a tough thing to say at the speed that they're playing. But it's the truth. It. Everything has to be Service over. absolutely on point. 14, 17. And they get their chance right now. Maulana's racket, in fact it was Fickley's racket. I guess you could say the same applies to the Indonesian pair as well. They can't really afford mistakes like that. A bit loose for Mike already. So far, so good in terms of the comeback. And the lift comes up a bit high. Attacking incentive shifted to the Indonesians off that lift. Still a bit lucky at the end, but they're closing in. 19, nice, instinctive little cross block almost from, well, it's actually straight down the line, but from Fikri. Good chance to close it out from here. Ready with the defense. They're pushing forward again. Oh, oh, absolutely off the cuff shoot from the hip defense. And it worked out for Fikri. Game points. So four game points. And their strategy of just upsetting the rhythm of Ranky and Chetty has worked absolutely perfectly. Looking good for this first game. from Mancaretti. Still not out of it yet. 
17, 20. Being very careful. Oh, unbelievable passage of play, but what an angle found by Maulana. And they take the first game 21 17. Important game two for the world number twos, and as you can tell from their discussion there, our insight, small adjustments need to be made so that they can get on top of the point. Because right now, they're being pushed into this defensive pack so quickly that it all gets a little Second confusing. Game, love all play. What they need to do is well, essentially do exactly what Fikri and Maulama have done to them. Push the point, try and get the attacking advantage. And hopefully look for the big shot and big angle. But the last thing they want to do, being a game down, is get into that reactive part where they're essentially defending. Without really thinking. better from them. What a rally. Oh, how flat these defensive shots coming in. Impossible retrievals coming from the racket of Fikri and then he drops that into front court. Service over. One. Oh. Well, that was more about both pairs really trying to fight for the advantage low defense 
all the time. Two, one. I think that's what they need to do. Mike Reddy and Chetty need to get that steepness of angle into their attack. Make it even more difficult for Fikri and Marlana to pull off these astounding defensive shots that we've seen so far. So good. applause it's for Lu Shi Feng on court one who's come to a marathon three game win against Cho Ken Chen and once again the home fans in full force here at the Olympic Stadium Better start from Mike and Shetty from this side of the court. And have a good chance. Vicky and Marlana sticking to what has been working, keeping it nice and flat over the net. A pacey approach to each point. And right now being powered off the shuffle. One down. to play for the Indonesians and that's why the Indian pair are taking their time with this point. <laughs> Slow down, break that rhythm up is always a admirable thing to do. Just beginning to cut Seven, into one. Vikri and Malana's strategy that worked so well in that first game. Shetty is definitely wanting to slow this game down as much as he can. There's a lengthy debate with the umpire as to the amount of moisture on court. And there's not going to be a wipe down either. I think that's to break down the rhythm. I think it's worked pretty well. Push it into the corner with Malana. 
Just not finding the range for those drives into the corner. Opportunity for Marlon to finish that off. They've just been netting a lot more. Nine, two. This hasn't been outright winners from Ranky and Shetty at all. They've benefited definitely from some of these mistakes. And again. Just trying to get all that moisture off the court. Both sets of players, actually. Okay, players, come here. Both sides, both of you. And both of them get a talking to. This is not fun. Stop playing the game. Okay. A stern reminder from our umpire. Can't have all four players doing the badminton moonwalk because it's a complete breakdown Ten, of two. the game. And he's right. 10 2. And at this point, it looks like the mid game interval is a formality out. for Rankaredi and Shetty, but they're going to have Try to wait. Shetty challenges called out. Patchy part to the match last five points and Chirag Shetty finally gets his court wiped down that he has been so ferociously campaigning for well, that's in correction in 11 to listen to interval noise. listen to the noise when they do like this with their shoes hello you can hear it. They don't want four players to get injured. so they can counter it. Here in the end, we catch one, two, a little bit out of balance, and then we just catch it. Court two, 20 seconds. Court two, 20 seconds. So back on court. Twelve. Two. Protest about moisture on court by the <laughs> Indian doubles coach Carsten, um, Matthias Boer as well. To bring that mid-game interval. But on we go. A nice pick up by Maulana. Oh. Service over. Three, twelve. You just think that if it does get to these areas where it's just reactive defense from both pairs, that you just think the Indonesian pair are going to come out on top, which is why Rankaredi and Shetty need to have oh. a set and firm Service strategy over. in place. 13 3. And certainly looking good for the second game. It's 
big opportunity for Smash. Fickery delivers, but it's the short shot in the end. That fails him, so they still have been... I'm going to use the word bamboozled out of this second game is what they have after that wonderful performance in the first. I think this now might be a bridge too far for them in the second. Which isn't a problem. Right, I want to be happy to see a third game between these two. All oh, these four. There's another mistake, this time from Fikri. Oh, this time from Malana. Three. 13 point lead. Service over for 16. Well, with all due respect to Rank Ready and Shetty, this has really been down to defensive flaws from Fikri and Malana, the fact that this lead is so big. There's another mistake hey. from them. Five, oh, six, what a eight. comeback this would be if they could bring it from here. I highly doubt it. It's not impossible, but it's highly improbable. And that power in, 17-5. Service over. 17-5. Well, just a forewarning. And it might get very loud Service in this forward. arena. Very soon. Six, Chen Yufei and Lu Guangzhou both playing on the other courts. Easy body. Seven, Shot seventeen. Four, Malana. Came back too high. Great shot there from the net cam. So the inevitable is drawing closer and closer, and that is, of course, Anki and Shetty taking this second game. I really can't see Fikri and Malan putting up that much of a defense. That attack's going to work. That was a pretty hard shot, actually. Even more of an apology that comes from it because it was, had that little bit more sting to it. 818. Oh, they're still fighting for it. And I'm not writing off their chances at all, but at the speed that these points are being played, I just think that errors far more likely. There's Service another over. one. 19-9. I myself personally think that this one is going to go to three. It's going to be decided in style, possibly even a spectacular grandstand finish. Chirag Shetty there that the court does indeed get wiped down. Can't have any complaints with that now. So 19-9 on serve and a chance for Ranky and Shetty to close out the second game. A couple of points off this serve. And it's in the bag. Well, 
That's a big lift. It's going to be long. Over 10, and made it to three. double digits. Pick me and Mal on it. Good rotation by the Indonesians. Ah, wonderful angle picked out by Shetty. Over. So, 10 game 20. points. Game point, 10. Victory defend that. Service over. Eleven twenty. Well, that's one saved. So, one game apiece and everything set up, and I guess it's only right that with two quarter-finalists from the World Championships on court that it should only go to three. 21-11 as they hit 40 minutes on court. Now we know the, the difference when we are like super active and how, and how much we need to move compared to here in the end, where we're like still like a little bit faster. Now we expect more from them. Okay, but we need to stick to it. We're going to be active, powerful, we're going to be something that we receive and be aggressive when we receive from two and four. We can have that one where we play the short one or that push one, not upwards in the backhand side. So we can use those again. Okay, most important thing is that we keep moving. Huh? We keep moving. If the partner has to be pushing up in the other side, if we hit, we're ready to smash one more time. Huh? If we on. Court two, 20 seconds. Court two, 20 seconds. Well, this is what it's all about as we get to the third and deciding game here in the men's doubles. First decider needed uh, this morning on court two. And as I said, only right when you look at the quality of both pairs that are actually playing. That second game, definitely a one-sided affair. Game. With Chirag Love and Satwick. On that first game was a well-contested contested affair. Great strategy from Fikri Malnana. Which one of those is going to prevail here? That's the great thing about deciding games. There can be only one. One of these great pairs facing a first-round exit. Which Service is it going to be? One, love. Two, two, love. These early points going to be so significant. Great defense by Maulana. Couldn't follow it up. One, two.
Now it's nice and flat from Ranky Reddy. That's what I was saying. So important to keep pace with this scoreline to the mid-game interval. And just after, what you don't want to be is four or five points behind in any decider. Oh, deep recovery from Shetty. Well done. He's pushed that wide. Wonderful defense from him, though, on that right side. Three, two. Here it is again. Well, that was the highlight through the leg shot. It was a shot before that was really impressive for a tall guy to get down that low. Well left oh. by Ranky Reddy. That Four, top right corner two. has been a little bit drifty today. <laughs> and now we're seeing a few more lifts in this match that might come into play it. a lot more. I get it. Oh, yeah. oh, slip. oh, oh. nice, wonderful oh. shot from Fickery just. Five, uh, front court two. just popped up right here. No, in fact, after this, pops up, hook smash down, and it's at the feet. Irretrievable. Five two, dangerous. And they're doing it again. Oh. 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 Three five. Oh, we're definitely going to need to pull in those service errors. It's been a couple of service errors from them. Understandable when you're trying to keep things that flat, but also, of course, hasn't been working out for him. So, 3-5. From Shetty no! again. Pressure came Service in, was too over. much for him. Six, three. Did well there with the crouch defense. And he was fully targeted. Couldn't come through, so it's six, three. Oh. Got picked up again by Fickery. Dominating the net. Wow, that was an unbelievable defense from Fikri and Maulana. And to end it on that shot, what a glorious shot to end it on. Seven, Have a look at this. Three. That was great. This was great. This was great. That was unbelievable. Wonderful stuff from them. 7-3. Oh, this time it didn't work for them. And it's pretty clear as to what their strategy is going to be for this third and deciding game. 7-4 up. They have a tiny buff. They just don't think it's going to be enough, though. Four, three points. Important serve for Ranky Shetty. Again, big four for Fickery. Five, seven. Frankie was lucky with that clipping of the tape.
you. So back on call after the quick wipe down. Five, seven. And I myself can't wait for the end of this third game because it's going to get very, very tight indeed. Evenly matched. Great first round tie. Oh, another wonderful pickup by Fikri. <laughs> An achievement in itself to get one of those. Greg Shetty smashes back over the net. Oh, great pick up there by Marlana. Service over. It's in the right place at the right time. Eight, six. As soon as that third shot, there it is. He was on top of it. 8 6. Took his eye off at the key moment. Over, seven, eight. Oh, absolutely everything to play for. Seven, eight. And still the implied protests at moisture on the court. Famed moonwalks happening more and more frequently. Great from Shetty. Wonderful teamwork by Fikri and Marana. Really played for each other in that point. Over. Nine, seven. Just keeping their head above water right now. And it's good teamwork by both of them. <laughs> oh, again, reactive. This time couldn't keep it in. Service over. Eight. To say these off the hip defenses. What a shot that would have been. Kept that in. So, 8-9. Most important serve yet. For Ranky and Shetty. Oh, oh Shetty tries his own reverse. Doesn't work out. So, 10-8. Closing in on the mid-game interval. Thank you. Oh, wonderful defense again. Oh, this one's in. Challenge being called, as you'd expect. Challenges called in. Now looked in from up here. I think he's going to be lucky. Closer than I thought, but still in. 11, eight. So 11-8, change ends. And that all-important mid-game interval lead falls away of Fikri and Malana. Just, just hold it short in front of 
So the mix of the Court two, 20 seconds. Court two, 20 seconds. Oh, as players get back on court for this absolutely crucial second phase to game three. You could just hear uh, Matthias Boas saying how Fikri is the dangerous one to look out for right now because he's really pushing forward. Well, oh, here we go. Again, deep serve. Oh. Get a hold of that one quickly. Nine, eleven. And a two point lead, just not enough Good. against a pair. The quality of Ranky Reddy and Shetty. They've done well to catch that up. They were 1.4 points back. Pushing them on that defensive back Ten, foot. 12. Great variation from Fikri Marlana. Oh, they were looking for that big winner and they found it. That was great court coverage from Marlana in the middle of that rally as well. Service over. 13, 10. Well, as I said before, such a shame that one of these pairs is going to have to exit at the first round when they both have such quality. But there are some really choice first round ties in all five disciplines here at uh, China Open in Changzhou and this was definitely the pick of the morning well saying that of course coming up next after this Li Zijia versus Kodai Narioka what a match that is wow so many reasons one of many great ties and as I said sad to see big stars go but that's just the way the cookie crumbles oh, great defense again from Fikri especially Lower pace, intentional, I'm sure. <laughs> steeper and steeper, four shots coming in. 11, 13. Still keeping pace with that scoreline. Two points back, getting to the business end of this deciding game. Jumped in by Shetty, and that's brought it back to one. Oh, 
Oh, what an angle into the corner. Fickery again. 14, 12. Oh, what an... Shetty team Ranky ready to do to bring this level. And that will definitely give them that little edge as they race for the last six or seven points. Very, very ambitious move by Ranky Reddy, and it pays off. Took a chance by getting that deep in front court. Had to make it work. Back to one point behind. Come close. Edge this away again. Both pairs rapidly running out of points to win. 15 13 on serve. Key point of Kukri and Maulana if they can make this a three point lead. It's 16 13. That would be. Ah, that's how you do it. So much venom in that shot coming down. Oh, things looking decidedly dodgy now for Rankaredi and Shetty. Oh, how did that come back? <laughs> Full marks to Shetty for continuing the attack, even though he really didn't expect that to come back 14, at all. 16. That one was in the right place. That's the advantage of being a very tall player. Just a leap over to the other side. Back down to two. Thirteens currently in it to win it, and if they can oust the world number twos after a day after the world number ones got taken out, well, that's left it nice and open in the men's doubles division. Alfin and Ardiento already out. Great performance by Astrup and Rasmussen on day one. Tight division. Fourteen, sixteen. Again, wonderful from Fikri. Pushed it to the back, set up 14. that shot, stayed up front, and made the kill 17 14. Three points ahead, four points needed. Oh. Oh, I was going to wait till they. they won that point but we've seen some amazing defense from them already <laughs> that one <laughs> look at this 18 14 just keeps coming back just the right time Chirag Shetty looks over at the big screen and I don't think he could believe it either absolutely Incredible defending from Fikri and Marlana, but I guess that's what you have to do when you're playing one of the best attacking sides in the division.
great performance again. Defensively at the front of the net, and they're just screaming away in these last few points. 19-14, they're just being very difficult to beat at the moment. Umpire calls for just a moment of calm. Oh! Close now. Well, headline making stuff here on court two. Six match points to the world number 13s. 65 minutes on court they've been. And this could be a shock exit for the world number twos at the China Open. It's the expected challenge coming through. Out. I'm sorry, guys. I'm a big supporter of what you've done, but that looked out. Oh, I could win it right here. Just out. Challenge unsuccessful. One That's one saved. <laughs> NMA, no mistakes allowed for Ranky Reddy and Shetty. 15, 20. Oh, it's been a defensive masterclass from Victory Malana, and they've just got to do it one more rally, one more time. Off. Ranky Reddy served. Did they get to it? Court coverage, unbelievable. It's another one saved. 16 20. Slight delays, we wait for yet another wipe down, which has been actually a running theme in this match. They are still four points back. The only route forward now is extra points. This mirroring that mammoth match that they had at the Thailand Open earlier this year. There's another one saved. Has to be perfect from them. into the corner they were looking to go straight onto the power but it's a shock defeat for Ranky Reddy and Shetty but really wasn't that much of a shock when you put in a performance like that defensively from Fikri and Maulana they really did deserve that 21-17 11-21-21-17 68 minutes and Vegas Molana, 21-17, 11-21-21-17. Unbelievable stuff from them. Very happy faces, as you can imagine, from the wall number 13s. And it's another big 
result here at the China Open on day two. And we will all wait to see what happens to them in round two. As for now, though, they have come through. And they have come through well. 21-17, 11-21, 21-17. Fikri and Maulana progress.